um, do you drink coffee or do you smoke or do you, you know, uh, do you drink alcohol or anything like that? Or like, yeah, great yeah. question. So, yeah. um, uh, I drink coffee, right? Okay. So I have like two cups two of coffee, coffee a day. Coffee. Right? Okay, I've yep. had zero so far, just so you know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 that's no, that's crazy, yeah. man. <laughs> really? That's, this is just this is how this is how I am. Like so, um, yeah. Like what happens is when I woke up in preparation for our interview, mm-hmm. right? I put myself in a peak peak state. That's all yeah, I did. Okay. So, <laughs> so that was you know? uh, that was your workout that you explained before about the muscle groups and stuff, right? Yeah, I didn't do that this morning yet because I don't wake up that early. You know? Yeah, I'm yeah. Too, right. So, <laughs> yeah. I'm like, okay, but there's other things too, right? I mean, there's things you can like. When you start realizing your body is simply a tool that you can manipulate in the way you want, right? Mm. It doesn't mean you're perfect every time, but then you can put yourself in the right state, mm. right? It's kind of like if you're really angry, you try smiling, it shifts how you think, right? Like it's mm. just what happens. So, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of like hey, if you're sad, you watch a funny movie, it changes how you feel. Like, you know, we're human beings are very easily influenced, mm. but you can also influence yourself in a different way. Right? So, so how, how did you put yourself in that peak state in the morning? What, what's your Today routine? Was really, so first my alarm goes off. I'm like, man, I'm tired. Like 3.30, yeah. that's pretty early. Like, <laughs> yeah. I don't I'm want to tired, do this podcast right? or interview door about it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But I'm, I'm like, I'm like but, but the thing is like when you have, um, uh, when you are massively with your purpose in life, mm. you know, things shift for you, right? So, um, clarity is massive power. I learned that early on. When you yep. lack clarity to your goals, it's hard. So I woke up. I'm like, okay, you know what? Like, I'm tired. I really rolled out of my bed. That was the first. I had to move. Once you start moving, it's, it's different, right? I moved. I brushed my teeth. I was still tired. I knew that was gonna happen, right? Mm. So I had to go right into my 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 typical routines that I normally do okay. to trigger my state, right? So I I forgot those small things. So for example, like I, I went downstairs. Um, I drink ice water, okay. apple cider vinegar, right? Okay. I immediately have my vitamins, right? So I take like, um, uh, I take um, a ginkgo balboa. So ginkgo, bal- ginkgo balboa pills, right? It's okay. for mental clarity and memory retention. Mm-hmm. It's, a, it's a natural herb. Uh, so I take that. I take some vitamin C, some fish oil, nothing crazy. That's really it. So, yep. um, and then uh, from there, like, you know, I still wasn't, I was still feeling tired. So, okay, I did a bunch of jumping jacks, mm. right? Just to get the blood flowing. Once the ball is flowing, okay, all right. And then I went and I just started, I, I was already like mentally just feeling like, I'm like all right, here we go. Mm. It's coming. You, 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 <laughs> you can feel, it's like a train far away, but you can feel it rumbling, <laughs> okay. right? Like, oh yeah, here it goes, here it goes. We're about to get going now, right? And then, um, and then from there, I'm good. And I knew once I got in the interview, it's on yeah yeah right because um the other piece too is um over time working in corporate america you get trained if you do it right how to put yourself in a peak state no matter how you feel how to always bring your a game right so like mm, yeah when you're like, when you're on a call and all that stuff like call yeah. right like you know like when you lead people like you know like they can't see you it's all all audio right yeah no matter how i felt i had to deliver right so yeah. it could be like you know it might be a situation where let's just say maybe I wake up at like three o'clock, <clears throat> three o'clock for a flight, fly somewhere. I'm, I'm, I'm a, it's a 17 hour day, right? Mm-hmm. And I'm all up in my hotel room that night. It's it's 8 30 PM. I'm exhausted. Yeah. And I find out I have a client call or whatever it is. Yeah. 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 Or maybe, you know, a clients are, are great. Maybe a, a top sales rep wanted to quit me. <clears throat> Funny retain them. Right. But mm-hmm. I mean, you can't lose town. Right. So, I need to be on my A game and be sharper and focus on my game to be able to be influential to influence and to stay. Mm-hmm. I couldn't do that feeling mentally weak. So I had give myself that peak performance, right? So nice. um, but go back to your question. So um a couple cups of coffee. Um okay. I I don't I don't really drink much anymore. I could have drink in a while ago. Like I mean, I just don't drink that much. I, re- I really don't. Um yep. okay. uh, I've just found like over time. Having mental clarity mm. is so critical, right? Because um, I, I have a very simple system. I call it the the M five system, right? M five system. M five system, and there's five things that um, I work to be in peak performance at, at all times, right? Cool. What is you that? Know, which, which is uh, my mind, right? So mentally, 
am I feeling on my A game? Mm. Right. And that's doing the things like some of the routine stuff, right? Feeding my brains, but also, hey, making sure like I don't only really watch the news, right? Like it's just, it doesn't really help me. Okay. All right. Like hanging out with people that can make me better. Mm. Right. Mm. You know, like, doing things like if if i get trolls online which happens like well, not yeah, happens, yeah. block them block and delete just, I, I don't want to do it anymore like i'm just like they're not, they're not bringing me down right yeah. so find a uh, muscle and i'm not talking about just like, being a physical strong like you just, you just physically feel healthy mm. so mind muscle muscle just being physically healthy just being healthy and i'm not saying everyone's gonna be super cut but just being healthy feeling good about yourself right like it's it's hard to uh you know to be great if you feel terrible, right? Mm. So really important, just be physically you feel healthy, right? So and that's everyone's different. So so mind muscle um, matter, you're matching your purpose. Okay. Are you on your, on your purpose? Really important. Mm. Are you doing things towards your purpose or matter, right? Mm. Uh, money. Are you financially in a good spot? Like are you making smart financial decisions? Right, like some people love the, the, the instant gratitude for sure. Like you know, I, I see it where like all of a sudden, when I was leading the team, a rep have a great month and they go and buy a brand new like you know nice like Breitling or Rolex watch, right? Yep. You know, because maybe they they saw some of my collection and I'm like, what you what you don't know, kid, is uh, I have earned it. Yeah. And I can afford to buy these things cash multiple times over. Mm. Because I built up to that point. I didn't wait for one check to buy it. <laughs> right? Like, yeah, yeah. Know, I think it was Grant Cardone said, like, um, you know, if you can't buy cash, then you probably shouldn't buy it, right? Something, something like that, right? So, yeah, yeah. You know, like, that's always the philosophy I've had. So, um, so the money piece is important, being financially set. So, because that's the number one stress for most people, right? Mm. And then last is um, marriage, right? Like, and uh, your spouse is definitely one big piece. Who you marry is massively important. Mm. <clears throat> What's also really important are if you treat the people around you that you spend the most time with like it's a marriage, do they make you better? Mm. So That's and interesting. it, it yeah. shifts your thinking a little bit, right? Mm. You might be like, you know what? Actually, I don't want to hang out with Tony because Tony is not making me better. I wouldn't marry Tony if I was a case. Like yeah. he's just a drinking buddy. So um those five things, right? The M5. By being focused on that, this gives me massive clarity on what I need to do, mm. which means eat healthy, do these certain things, work out, be good with finances, <clears throat> spend time with the right people, right? And ultimately, M5 will, has led to some pretty cool results in my personal life and professional mm. life, and it's, it's helps me in my business in so many different ways, too. Yep, yep. Nice. Awesome. Um, so you've been doing that for quite some time, right? A few years, uh, M5 or something that Probably you've created? Like, Oh, 14, 15 years. 14 years. Nice. Incredible. It's, okay. um, it's, built, it's built over time though. So it's not, yeah. it wasn't overnight. It started small. It's kind of like my morning routine. It yeah. started like small. And then as you start learning about other things, you get more awareness. You know what? A mm. lot of people follow the code they follow. Well, what's mine? Mm. What's important mm. to me? Mm. Like, and by having that clarity, it allows you. And over time, at one point, it's probably like an M2 system, right? Yeah. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? You know? And then eventually, I'm like, okay, you know what? Like, what's stuff I can really think about? What else is really important, right? What else would I need? 